Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a double header break. Two jumbo cases of 2020 Topps Series 1 baseball. This is random team break number 19 from, I forgot the 9 right there, number 19 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. The brand new 2020 Topps Series 1 baseball. Remember we did a bunch of cases in Dallas, which was awesome. We got some more here, which is also awesome. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. Now, we only sold 27 spots because there are some combos right here. A's, O's, Marlins, Twins, D-backs, Pirates. Nice. D-backs, Pirates, Orioles, A's, Marlins, Twins. Awesome. You don't have the cases? I, didn't bring, I did not bring the cases. Let's roll it and randomize it. Oh, I'm thrilled about this, Bill. I got Nick's help. That's why I'm thrilled. Two and a two, four times. I was doing this by myself. Two and a two, four times for each list. One, two, three, four. Tyler down to Nick. Two and a two, four times for the hard way for the teams. One, two, three, and four. After four times, we've got the red legs all the way down to the brew crew. Yes. Oh, jeez. Hit oh, okay. Oh, God. It's supposed to be right there. It's on the top. Why wouldn't it show? Because it's not that. It's new Nick Cam. I just typed that in. Those are your teams right there. You want to try to find it? Yeah. As a Red Sox fan, you apologize to the Dodgers fans. Oh, there it is. You don't have to apologize to me. The Twins should be apologizing. Oh, oh, you move the whole thing. You got to click it. Wait, click that until it's red. There you go. All right, so Nick's going to start ripping. Um, all right, so... So that's being opened right now. Nick's going to open them on the Nick cam right above my head. Tyler with the Reds. Anthony with the Nationals. EA with the Diamondbacks Pirates combo. Chris with the Rockies. Stacy with the Mariners. Kyle with the Dodgers. Diane with the Blue Jays. SKS with the Red Sox. Kevin with the White Sox. Chris Bowman with the Phillies. David with the Angels. Frank with the Rangers. Paul with the Rays. Uh, Big Boys 007 with the Padres. Kyle with the Giants. Dwayne with the Braves. Fred O with the Tigers. Rick T with the Indians. Eric Brand with the Marlins Twins combo. EA with the Orioles A's combo. Jeff with the Yankees. Kevin with the Cubs. William with the Astros. Chris with the Royals. Ryan with the Cardinals. Scott with the Mets. And Nick Coba with the Brew Crew. We got Jip the poster. What? There's no poster? That Series 2 poster. Unbelievable. To send the case back to Tops. Where's that poster? Alright, let's sort by column B by team. There is a series one checklist. Is anyone going to. Frank wants to know if anybody wants the Rangers. Sorry, Tops. Oh, boy. Tops, we love you again. It was in between the boxes. You can give it to the kid. All right, looks like no trades, so let's close up the trade window. So if you're wondering what, you know, I got randomized this team, I don't feel like trading, what do I have? You can look at that checklist that I dropped in the chat. It, you get the same team for both. Correct, you get the same team for both. It's the 12 box jumbo double header. Don't know how to spell double header, it's an E right there. You open those at the end? Or? Yeah, I open the silver packs at the end. So it doesn't get mixed in when it's sorting. It's all just one stack because all those shit. What about these? Those I open up at the end of each box. 
no. No matter Everything <laughs> ships. Nice try, Frank. Although you do get a stack of 70, I think, cards. So. If you bought a spot. If you bought multiple, you get. Can you write that down? On oh, on the sheet. Each team All right, so as it says in the item description, each team gets 75 random vet commons. It's just a note for the shipping team as well to remind them. We haven't gotten the cards back from Dallas yet. They don't come until Monday. That was the fastest because they weighed so much. That was the fastest that we could ship them. So we'll start sorting those once they come here Monday. If you bought a personal case, those all shipped out from Dallas since we had time to just pack them. So probably these cards will probably be going at around the same time as the Dallas one. I think Jason's saying maybe a week or two, so probably about that that time range. We would have flown back with them, but I don't know. We were a little nervous about getting damaged by Delta. Delta, Delta, Delta. All right. Good luck, everybody. So as you learned when you were watching all of our breaks from Dallas, obviously anything after these foil cards are something especial. Like that Gavin Lux, I guess. So those, if it's not an insert, it'll it'll be a variation. So it'll be an either either an insert or some sort of variation, which we'll set aside right there. That foil card will ship. Insert ship, rookie card ship. It's just veteran commons that won't ship, but you will get a stack of veteran commons as it says in the item description. I don't think so. so. After Although this I have been sick this week, so maybe... I, I have, like, I think maybe Corona. <laughs> I better not get it. I got sick right after, like, in the, in my, on my second case I was breaking. And after that foil is this card right here, the Austin Meadows. That'll be for Paul Hutchins and the Rays. Do they have a Corona shot? That's 2020. That's for the Phillies. That'll be for Chris Bowman. 2021? Oh, yeah, probably not. I got the swine flu shot. Just got, just got to ride it out. And there's Clayton Kershaw. It's got to be some kind of variation or short print or what have you. And let's get a move on. What? The Zaw? Yeah. Hank Aaron die cut. It's when very different. Doing the randomizer. Is that when you ordered it? Yeah, I guess. 
a lot less busy than uh, than it was when we ordered Super Bowl Sunday. Yeah, I didn't go to Mickey. We did Domino's. Oh, Domino's. They're really close. And decades best, Mike Trout. <laughs> what are you doing? Is that a plate? Yeah. That's pretty cool. It looks like. It's like, what are you looking at? But then it looks like. Oh, there's a plate coming up in about we didn't hit one of those two hours. This is not two hours. <laughs> These took me and Jason. These are actually are not long. These took me and Jason 30 minutes each. No pack sack. Why? It took me an hour yesterday. Yeah. Come on. We got Logan gotta, Allen. Gotta speed that rookie up. Rookie auto. I just physically can't, I think. 42 out of 50. See, this is why I didn't make the travel team, folks. I would get like 45 minutes, but come on. I mean, maybe if I'm in a rhythm, yeah, yeah. Maybe if I did like two or three cases in a row, I could get like the third case down to 45 minutes. Yeah, I mean, it was your first case. It was my first case. I was just kind of like, what's this? This looks cool. And yeah. This is Cody insert. Bellinger. Sorry. Yeah, that's a problem. Once you go off your diet, like, you get sick. Wait, unless Bill's diet was Chinese food and vodka. Yeah. Johnny Bench die cut and a one out of fifty Raphael Devers. I like these these patches right here. They think they're manufactured patches, but they still look they still look really cool. So all these inserts and stuff and that Shohei will definitely ship. All the RCs will ship. Just in the interest of time, we're kind of Tony Gonzalez will ship. And Johnny Bench is to 299 for the red leg. That's for Tyler Stump. Got randomized the Reds. So you'll get this and all the other RC Dodgers, Kyle Armstrong. Thank you, Nick. Bo Bichette. Look at that high leg kick right there by Keegan Hernandez. The Lou Gehrig will go to Jeff and the Yankees. And the Boba Shed, this and all the other ones that I've probably breezed by, will go to Diane and the Blue Jays. He'll be the big, uh, the big rookie name for, the, for this year. All right, so right now we're doing the double header. After this will be another contender's half case break. Then we are giving away break credit. I think Nico Herner should be kind of a bigger rookie name. He had a good debut last year. We've got Decades Best, Texas Rangers. After Rendon is Yusai Kuchi. The short print or a variation or something like that. Oh, to 300. I think these are the advanced stats ones that are to 300. Um, 
And there's Nolan Arenado. Uh, Optic drops next Wednesday, Nick. Optic Hoops. That should be a big new release for next Wednesday. We're looking forward to that. And we got Cesar Hernandez for the Phillies. That is for Chris Bowman. Um, yeah, a little bit, Bill. I think I think everyone still in their heads, but there's the conscious decision to kind of move on, to try to move on. They have not done Kobe's memorial thing yet, which I'm going to try to go to. Um, but... Vanessa Bryant took all of the, uh, I think, cataloged a lot of the gifts that they got that people left at LA Live across the street from Staples Center and at the um, and uh, at the practice center. All the flowers that the people left, I think, uh, are going to be composted and then put into the the plants and planters around LA, around downtown LA and stuff like that. So. I think people are still pretty bummed, but I mean, day by day, I think it's getting a little bit better. There's Brandon McKay. That's one of the big rookies for for this year. Could be a Shohei Otani type player. That's a 99. Yeah, there could be autographs in the in those uh, blue slash silver packs back there. Yeah, one of ones, and they're all they're all special like Mojo Refractor inserts, so they got a special pattern there too. And behind there is Manny Machado, Padres going to Big Boys Double O Seven. And inserts like this, of course, will ship. On the site? Yeah. Mostly. No, that limited we can still do, Nick LaPlante. There's still seven left on that number block. Oh, and that 27, what about 2017 Optic Football? Chase Patrick Mahomes is. Got another box of Spectra. We got the Freak Mix. We got some things that we can work on, some good things that we can work on. Uh, I think McKay made his debut last year. I think he put in some games last year. But I think the hope is that he'll be that he'll be more of a more of a starter this year. So he got a cup of coffee last year, and hopefully he'll make the team and be a regular contributor this year. Still think he has rookie eligibility, so he should be could be a rookie of the year candidate. He can pitch and he can hit. Seth Brown to 2020. And we got Joey Votto. Cincinnati Reds. Oh, Canada. Do, 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 do. There's Garrett Cole. Looks like some sort of variation there. Oh, that card right there. I was like, that, some card feels weird. It was that die cut. So Mariano Rivera, of course, goes to Jeff and the Yankees. And this will also go to you. Garrett Cole, already in his Yankees gear. How do they do that? 
Remember, they went to the future. Christian Yelich. Felt like a different, what's, what is this? Oh, looks like just some cardboard dust right there. First, I thought they had they put glue there. That'll go to the Brew Crew. That's that'll be for Nick Coba and the Brewers. What? That game? That game's on? Yeah. I'm, there's Nico Herner. That's a variation. Six nine one. There's Nico Herner. Duke, North Carolina. You're not watching either of these. What? Why is that on? What channel is this on then? ABC? Could be an ABC game. It's Saturday. There we go. Oh, it is an ABC game. I think the Warriors on all the time. Eleven out of sixty-nine. I think they still thought Steph Curry would be would be around. If people at least want to tune in for Steph Curry. Vlad Jr. to sixty-nine. Nice Blue Jays. Uh, Diane, I think, with the Blue Jays. Yep. There you go, Diane, with the Bluebirds. And Logan Allen, 107 out of 199. Indians auto going to Rick Thomas. And after this... Red Sox team card is going to be Riggy Henderson, the man of steel for the A's. O's A's combo, EA with the OA. And next stack here. Ooh, nice nickel plant. You got your Drew Lock auto redemption. There you go. Thanks, Drew. Dustin May. Dustin May to 2020. Could be a big part of that Dodgers rotation this year. We can start him. Is that him? Nolan Ryan die cut. Remember LeBron traded Angel Reigns for Kevin Love? Did he? Yeah, the Cavs originally drafted. Oh, that's right. He got rid of Anthony Bennett too, didn't he? Well, yeah, and then nobody took him. Sad times. It's like my career ruined by LeBron James. Maybe Wiggins isn't Or no, that is. That's him. There he is right there, yeah. At Carpenter 2020. Cardinals, that'll be for Ryan. Ooh, JaVel McGee said, get out. Get out, Andrew. And we got Andre Dawson to 299. And Anthony Rizzo to 149. Big Cubs logo right there. Those look pretty sharp. K 
Kevin with the Cubs. Juan Soto. Woo. Thanks, Nick. Yeah, so you can just say this. What do you want to do? I'm going to slide those up front and we'll slide those in the back. We'll move these. It's just then I got to look them over. Oh, that the lip on the mat there. So this is still three boxes from the first case. They're all being shown. Right here, yeah, they're all being shown. So you'll see it, you'll get it. And I'll rip those packs. Oh yeah. And then I'll start sleeping and top loading. All right. Thank you. All right. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Big thanks to Nick for unboxing everything now. Let's just breeze through these. There's the babe. Let's see what we get. I feel like I've not spotted any Jordan Alvarez rookie cards. Are those not too common? What's he? I've hit a lot. I've hit like one per box. Oh, maybe I'm just, maybe he's been upside down. I hate these box toppers. A lot of them come with ink. That sucks. You just kind of rattle around that box. Yeah. Hunter Renfro, 2020. Baseball player Hunter Renfro. Dansby Swanson, Braves. Dirty Astros garbage can jokes. Or whatever it is. Like banging. Like they're cheating. Uh huh. A lot of those jokes in Dallas. Like oh. Every breaker had a joke about it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Was there, was there any good ones? No. They're all pretty bad. It's like, oh, you know, they should put the wire relics for Altuve. Like right, 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 yeah. I mean, we've heard that from day one. Yeah. And then there's this part of. Bregman in this set where it's an iPad filming him on the card. I did see that. I don't That's... know if it's supposed to be. I don't, I don't think I'm, or I don't think Tops would do that on purpose. Seems like it was it was in production before. Yeah. There's a Gavin Lux. Ironic, I guess. To 300. Nice. Advanced stats, Gavin Lux. Oh, there's the plate. I felt the coolness of the plate on my hands. That was, that was refreshing. All right, so that's... And it's for the Blue Jays. It's Anthony K. Anthony K. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. That is for Diane and the Bluebirds. What the hell happened here? It must be from the, the ink from the plate. Got on the back of Marwin Gonzalez. That literally must just, just have taken it out of the factory and put it right into the set. Yeah, yeah play to the whistle, Frank. We're not even we're not even halfway done with this. Not even close. And there's Jordan Yamamoto, rookie autograph. 
There you go for the Marlins. That's going to be for Eric Brand with the Marlins Twins combo. This set is more about more about the variations and the and the rookie cards really as opposed to the hits themselves. So like stuff like this Max Scherzer right here, right where he's hitting. That's a different. That's a variation for the Nationals. That's for Anthony. See that goaltending in the Portland game? Yeah, Woj. That was wild. It was just after the foil, I was just pulling this. Just have it pattern. Like this Warren Spawn. So is that deal, is that trade like dead? No, because the twins are just like, I don't want to, we don't want to send anybody else? That He's seems to be, the Vets yeah. I think it's, well one was the hope for Duco harassment. Thing. What? Really? Yeah, he like, it's bad stuff last year. And then I know one of the other things Nice was, patch, Acuna Jr., um, Dwayne Sherman. by one of the Dodgers prospects. Oh. No, I thought it was the Twins prospect, Bruce Star Greaterall, of the Twins, had a shoulder issue. That's what kicked everything off. I heard on Sirius XM it was also the Verdugo. Hmm. He, like, harassed the Hmm. I don't remember that. (laughs) It was there, huh? Okay. I'm not saying it was true or not. I'm not saying it was whose fault, I don't know, but I heard that's holding part of it up. But you'd think the Red Sox are right. Well, now everyone's in an awkward position then because it's just not, it's like, oh, like, Mookie, we want you back. Yeah. It just makes it weird. In the clubhouse and for the front office. I, I hope it goes through because I want Jock Peterson and Ross Stripling. Ross Stripling is underrated. He's going to be a great addition. I'm Dod- Dodgers never gave him. I'm excited him. about Jock Peterson. He's a huge upgrade for Cole Calhoun. Yes. He is, he is younger, faster Cole Calhoun. Cole Calhoun couldn't run. That was the problem. Jock, then, Jock, yeah. can actually, Jock actually has a little Cole's bit of speed. Good at, uh, defense, which I'm not sure Jock is great at, but... Jock's pretty good at defense. He his his speed helps him like yeah. run around and like nice Aaron Nola, great autograph. Phillies. I don't know though. It might be busy because we got Joe Adele probably being called up next year. We have Upton coming back. Trout obviously. We have um... trade night seems to be seems to be rocking. There's a lot of people yeah. milling around. Yeah. So. Yeah, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, Almost 20 people in the shop right now. Doing a raffle in about 25 minutes. We do have a raffle, so people are going to be involved in the free raffle. Nice Josh Bell variation. I know that pizza is making me hungry. You're still under the weather, so you're just kind of like, you're hungry, but then your body will be, will reject it. <laughs> and then all, all this crazy medicine just stinks. They're all loopy. Yeah. I mean, we got a hot mic. You better I've watch been, out. I've been trying all the different medicines. Yeah. We got, what do you, just have a cold or what? Yeah, but it's like a bad I'm on cold. antibiotics. I'm not really contagious anymore, but it's still like lingering. That's the worst. Yeah. The lingering, the like and the. I'm, like wheezing and it's just a mess. 
my doctor told me to buy a pulse ox. Um, a what? A pulse ox. You know the thing they put on your finger at the doctor's uh-huh. office to rate your oxygen level? Wow. He said I need one of those because of, of my breathing. And if it's under 95, you have to go to medical attention. And mine was 96. 95? Well, like, what's the, I don't know what the scale is. What's the rating? I think it's 100. So, but what is, what is it? What is it? So you have a hundred, all right. Like 90, so I've got 96%. So that must of be. optimum o- oxygen level? Okay. Can't, can't you just breathe more? <laughs> Does not work that way? No. <laughs> You're like, oh, I'm at 95. No. But when you breathe in, only 90%, 96% of oh. oxygen is getting into your lungs. You gotta get in early, Logan. We we still have all these breaks early. I know. Where were you earlier, Lo- Logan? Not being here early to buy into breaks makes me sad. You gotta buy your spots before Joe even goes live. I shot out an email blast today. We yep. sold out that Leaf Pearl fast blue. Fast. And those were we had fire. Michael Jordan letter. You know, Charles Dickens cut autograph. Yeah. Muhammad Ali cut auto. So it's just this. Like we're getting busier and busier. We're just gonna start filling breaks quicker. Can't snooze, Logan. So it's just the, just like the supply is. Probably a good idea. Probably a good idea to, to get those pre-orders for Donner's Optic Basketball, right? Yeah, get those ASAP. Tomorrow, play some patches football. Man. Select football. A lot of pre-orders going up. Buy early and often. NBA All Star Mixer. Got to get in early and often, ladies and gentlemen. Don't miss out. Well, yeah, I, unless you're just looking for flawless. Maybe you were just looking for flawless. Yeah, I can see that every day, though. Kevin Vigio. Only a certain amount of cases. 2020. And, oh, Canada. You didn't want to get on the Leaf Pearl? Logan, did you see that? Miss that. that. Pearl was fire. Got a lot of that 2017. 2017 Patrick Mahomes edition. We can chase that. We'll do an NBA championship mixer. But first is the All Star game. We'll be doing. I'm not sure how many boxes we'll get. So you missed it. I guess you. So you weren't checking all day. That makes me sad, Logan. Making me sad. Are you guys talking about drug deals right now? No, he wants to break into Oh. No, go on. Go on. It's great. Is there stuff on a cart now or is there Yeah, there is. And I can just pull it out. Slide it out. Yeah. That's another thing. Or should I just take the magnets out better? Because if I don't want to leave them on the cart, with people walking around and start grabbing them off the cart. Yeah. You might have to Maybe just go live and just have the bar kind of empty. And say we have breaks boxes on our website, jazzbees.com. No, you got to put them on the speed rack there. Yeah. Take some out then manually. There is Ken Griffey Jr., 20 out of 25. Killing me, Smalls. Nice low number on that. Game used material. Stacy with that one. I can't believe Tops didn't interview me. Yeah, why didn't Tops interview you? I was disappointed. I love the event, but I was disappointed by that. Yeah. I got interviewed by Sports Illustrated. I told, I, I told the boss man right away, and he was like, what? I was yeah. like, yeah, they got three quarters of the breakers were on the main stage getting interviewed by the MC lady that was doing all that she did a pretty good job and and i was like i was watching all day and night i did not see i did not see anything mike tried variation so maybe they said they said you we, we, don't get a good booth and we don't get a good booth and an interview no. jaspies just crushes it on social media so we don't need they don't need our help maybe they're ages man oh they're too young yeah no i'm just joking Maybe because my dad mm. works for Tops and they say... I know, they, they don't want to show favoritism. Yeah. They'd be like, oh, of course. 
Yeah, For, I former, might be in Sports Illustrated. Might be on the cover. Former Tops employee. Always getting the. They already got the nice table. Got the Ginter card. Got the Ginter card. Oh yeah, everyone thinks that's rigged for sure. East Coast bias. East Coast bias. Strikes again. Oh, it's Bill. It's true. East Coast bias is true. No, but Mojo Break was on there. They got an so oh. I'm not going to be salty about it. Who else from California was there? Mojo's there. He, they're from yeah. Northern California. I think that's it. Oh, that was it. I, what happened to the? Uh, really, there are a lot of new faces. A lot of new people that I haven't ever met. I saw Mr. Fish have blow cards. I saw Fish walking he around. He me on the whole night. Yeah, Fish is a good guy. Yeah, I accidentally. So my dad packed the computer in the panini box. Oh no! So I unpacked the panini wow. Box. I mean, I read a bit really quick, but At the top fish party, Fish up, saw it. He goes up to the top guy. Did he guy grab? And oh he tells wow! Him, and he says, "Nick, come over here." And the top the, the top, did, was was it Kevin O'Neill that yeah, he talked to? Says Kevin O'Neill. Oh Look at boy. One ninety one. That's why we didn't get the interview. There's like Jaspie's traveling with panini boxes. No interviews for them, said Kevin O'Neill. Damn it. So I apologize to Kevin and the whole Tops team for bringing a panini box. Sorry, Kevin O'Neill. That former Tops employee should know better. Yeah, that was embarrassing. That, I got run in the face. This is your variation right there, 20 out of 20. Was there a Rangers autograph? It was probably a facsimile autograph. Ooh, we have Victor and the Pokemon expert here. Mm. Bring it, people will bring the Pokemon collections, it looks like. Whoa. Asking him for some advice, maybe buying, maybe selling, maybe trading. Trading some Pokemon? Yeah, that's right, Frank. One of these days, Tops will be begging to interview us. Can, can we get you on our social media? be like, eh. No, they did a lot for us. They posted us in that tour. Like, you know, I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, and not every breaker was interviewed, so maybe maybe the next event will... Peterson makes the cut. Nice low number, Jock Peterson. Take care of Jock Peterson, Angels. Maybe we're on the list for... I mean, they're going to do it again. So. I think this will be one of the big names this year, too. That Aquino for the Reds. We need to have our... Um, Unnamed source at tops. There next time. <laughs> ah, I see. And there's Jordan Alvarez. That's a variation. Nice. Numbered. 8, 10 out of 20, 20. That's strong. We, we also have Yohan Mankata. 121 out of 149. Nice. Jason Lashock, Chris Davis is from Mexico. Not, not C. Davis, but K. Davis. K. Chris Davis is, from Mex is born in Mexico? He's got the Mexico flag on here. Wow. Right? I did not know that either. Did you also see the Panini error? No. Uh-oh. The Kendrick, happened? you know, Kendrick Nunn, like NBA rookie. Yeah, the year for the or Miami or Heat. Yeah. They didn't put his name on the cards of, on Optic. Oh, it's like his first rookie. So the no-name variation? Yeah. But, it's, but it was <laughs> not, not intentional? Not intentional. Remember when error cards used to be error cards and yeah, they were like special? Like now they're just mistakes. Now everyone's just like, oh. Well, now they do it on purpose. Right. Right, right. It'll be like worth a million dollars. It's an amazing time. Was that a Rangers auto? I don't I don't think it was. No. There's Nick Pavetta. It's a different you can kinda see there's a different finish on the back. Yeah, there was, a, pretty there cool. was Nick Solak auto to 199. Oh, damn it. What? Oh, did I set it aside? Yeah. Oh. Top oh, there it is. Oh, there was a Rangers auto. There you go, Frank. Sorry. I thought it was a facsimile autograph. No, you didn't pass by it. Yeah, there's G. Oh, the ones with like the yeah. the mat, the, the mat back. Yeah, because yeah, it felt really weird when I was going through the cards. I was like, wait, it creeped me out. 
doesn't like buttons. Buttons? Like yeah. button cards? Buttons in general. <laughs> I, I have triphobia. I get freaked out by clusters of holes. So we both have our things. Clusters of holes. Yeah. Or so like if you were, and stuff, I get freaked out. What if you were in like the prairie and there were like prairie dogs in their holes? No, I don't mind those. There's Nolan Arenado. I mean, there's not a limit, but just like. Um, you mean like the fee, the amount we should give him? Mm -hmm. well, what would you Behind it, I mean, it's not a there's Roy Oswald. Nothing too crazy. But anything that we could turn around. Yeah. I think that Nick Solak for the Rangers, Frank, wasn't he a top pick? I, saw, I feel like we saw him in a lot of Bowman yeah, draft. He's a good, good rookie. And behind Brock Holt <laughs> is Ian Kennedy for the Royals. 20 out of 20, or to 2020. Chris to Hart. I feel like we didn't really even promote it that much either, or as much as we. Oh, did you? I spent a few hundred bucks on social media. Whoa! I didn't even notice. Yeah. On Instagram. Maybe it was not. I do not. I'm trying to try to get back into That's it. That's our biggest thing right now. Ten point four thousand followers in the ground. Wow. We'll put on there. Maybe you should just have Jaspies re re repost my stuff and then I'll there's uh Brian Reynolds increase my followers out of one ninety nine. That goes to the Pirates. That's the uh, for Diamondbacks Pirates combo EA with that. Yeah, one. I slide in from I slide into the Jaspies. I slide in from the Jaspies account into DMs all the time. Wow, wow. <laughs> Is that unprofessional? I mean, we need that ver uh, verification badge. Would love that verification badge. Then, then, the, then the ladies will be DMing us all the time. Twitter, I think we've been Robin Yount variation. We've been in the three thousand range for about three years. Twitter is hard to gain followers. <coughs> I think we might post too much links. I guess Twitter's dead. Why don't you put the ABC game on too? Pedro Martinez. And then we've got Abraham Toro, Bull. And then we've got Alex Bregman, Astros, America, 23 out of 50. All right, next box. Yeah, National Treasures Basketball is going to be pretty incredible whenever that drops. Prepare yourself for the prices, ladies and gentlemen. Just brace yourselves. But that's always one of our big sellers every year, so... Looking forward to it. And we got Dan Vogelbach to 2020. Behind Dansby is a Frank Thomas relic. Nice. That'll be for 
The White Sox, Kevin M. with the Southsiders. And there's Max Kepler. That's a nice shot of him diving there. There's Jordan Alvarez right there. That should be one of the big rookies for this year. For baseball fans out there, what are, what are some of the rookies you're looking forward to? I think for me, in general, I want to, any any rookie that's good for the hobby, you definitely want to see do well. But obviously, as a Dodgers fan, would really love to see Gavin Lux in that second base position do well. Dodgers have kind of had a bit of a black hole at second base for a, for a long time. They've got prospects everywhere else. They had guys. They have guys like Dustin May. And found Max Muncy. Uh, that's uh, Mauricio Dubon to three hundred. That's one of those advanced statistics cards. Gilo, you're excited about Gavin Lux because you have a lot of his stuff. Yeah, hey. Good for the hobby. That's what we want to see. Nice. Are people actually trading? I think so. Ooh, deals are getting done? Whoa. I didn't sign up on permission. I was like, don't go too crazy. Hassan Diaz. That's another big rookie for the Marlins. He made his debut last year. Um, Marlins twins combo, Eric Brand. A little nervous about that falling over. Um, Isan Diaz actually played some pretty good baseball last year. There was a few breakers. I won't name names. Uh oh. Going a little nuts on the Yamamoto name. It was like got a little bit on the board. Oh boy. Yeah. They, they put put a little extra yeah, like, English yeah, to it. Like, <laughs> put a little extra English to it. Yeah. And then, He's American. They know that, right? <laughs> and then some nearby breakers. They were getting mad at these other breakers. And there was a, like, a lot of curse words. Whoa. So there's a little They're... bit of juice, but... Yeah. These are facsimile autos, obviously. <laughs> um, <laughs> Tops accidentally put one in here. They're oh! Um, yeah, maybe they were confused on, on how it worked, but I, when a lot of times they said it had to come from a fresh pack, I think maybe... I think they, they were not grabbing from the... Torch. Yeah, I don't think they are grabbing from fresh packs. There was no way, because some people would be like, they would some get up... Some were very quick, but, I mean, it was eight, 19 breakers opening. Nice, out of two ninety nine to Tatis Jr. Opening a lot of packs at once. So and Elvis I mean, Andrews, Strangers. Uh, but we won a few the right way, so, you know, I can't hate. It was nice that they did. They had a lot of nice giveaways. Did they do anything at the... Was there a closing ceremony at the end when you guys no, stayed late? No, but we late? won the very last bounty. Oh, what was that? Um, it was a few hobby boxes. Oh, nice. <coughs> so, yeah, we'll put the list together. Maybe tomorrow if we're live, and if not, Monday. Still trying to see if Teddy will break on the main site tomorrow. Whoa! Big leagues, huh? The bigs. He likes Instagram because he can just kind of chill. You know? Kind of like...
But yeah, overall, the internet worked very well. Yeah, there was there was zero issues. I was watching the stream. Someone tweeted out. You want me to? Max Kepler. Is there any pizza left? <laughs> I don't know. I think there might be a hidden... Your mom might hit some of that. Oh, hit a za? Maybe some chips for you. All right, I guess it'll just be chips. Oh, did we put all those chips out? We have so many chips. Oh, okay. Let's have Girl Scout cookies out there. Oh, yeah. Wait, we're... Oh, not... I was like, don't don't put my no. dosey dos out there. Um, the best Girl Scout cookies yeah. ever. Got suckered into buying the ones. Not sucker, but... What, our postal lady? Sucker this? No, no, um, this was a... Grocery store? Uh, little, that, um, the, the regular little kid who comes in all the time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. With the glasses? Sister, yeah. <coughs> Isn't that, I don't think that's allowed. You can't sell... He's here. He's a hustler. He's a hustler. He's going to take no. our jobs one day. Probably. Money, <laughs> he's gonna, he's gonna be breaking here in fifteen years. We're scouting potential group breakers, ladies and gentlemen. The farm system. Yeah, this is our farm system. The kids who are gonna do our jobs in ten years, so we don't have to do this anymore. There's Ken Giles, and just kick back and oh, sorry, these are just. Just kick back and just rake in the money. Sit back. I got one. In, I got one. That in our was in our money chairs. Sixteen out of seventy six. One off being seventeen seventy six for the seventeen seventy six. Yeah, that era. that would that would have been cool. I wonder if someone's gonna do the seventeen out of seventy six set. Ooh, Jersey and Auto Max Scherzer, forty one out of fifty. That's pretty solid. That's for Anthony and the Nationals, and that was last spot mojo. Great. Picture of the decade. It's pretty close. Him or Kershaw. How many World Series for Kershaw? Two. How many wins? I mean, without cheating, probably a lot. The Nationals didn't cheat. Oh, oh. the Astros. <laughs> 2017, <laughs> and then this team. There's <laughs> Julio <laughs> Tehran. I hope so. You can have their have their small hands open up se series one. Oh, who? I wonder if uh, Mike Harmon will come by from Fox Sports Radio. Yeah, well, I listen to Jason Smith, and Mike Harmon every day when I get home. Go home. Yeah, they're on. Yeah, they're on till eleven, and so like I get about I'm thirty still minutes of their show. Oh, I think I, I think I looked him up. Ken Griffey Jr. No, Murica. The, oh, voices. The he's the. Like, like, lighter voice, he yeah, he's the he's the non-host voice. He's like the secondary yeah. voice. So that's how I always three know. Guys on it. Oh, if it's three guys, I wouldn't know. But Jason Smith is like the technically the, the host, guy. so he does the ins and outs and all that. And then Harmon will commentate afterwards. Yo, you listen to Ben Maller? Yeah, I get some Ben Maller too later at night when I'm driving home. He's got kind of a weird show, but I guess that's what happens when you have overnights. Yeah, like Harmon's a nice guy. He comes in a lot. Nice, yeah. So if you're in the area, folks, there's another one for Frank and the Rangers. Another Nick Solak, number 
2020. Uh, Les Grobstein, 670 the score. Well, for, Why don't you think they traded Kuzma for Marcus Morris? I, I, I don't know. It was Cody Bellinger. I think your 670 is different from my 670, Frank. I think the, uh, the Lakers needed some intense, like a tough defense. I think they think they have enough length with LeBron and Anthony Davis <laughs> and Dwight Howard. They want more outside. They need a. Don't play a lot of defense, they need a ball. They need a Darren Collison actually. They need a ball handler. Yeah. I just think Mark I like the, I like I would have loved the Morris deal. That was the one thing that Mike Harmon show was talking about. They were ripping on the Lakers because he he goes to the team that can play in the Western Conference Finals. Well, the Clippers also wanted Darren Collison, so I think. <laughs> I think if the Lakers can get Darren Collison as sort of a ball handler, then those interior guys can do their, their thing. But yeah, no, he's right though. Morris can can neutralize. I do. Can neutralize, like... I don't think he's going to stop Dwight Howard, but... Yeah. He can certainly not make it easy for him. Yeah, he's kind of a leader. Yeah. But if they get Collison, who are they going to cut Rondo? No, probably like um, DeMarcus Cousins. It's Carlos Correa variation. I think Cousins is still like number 15 on that roster. Ooh, raffle starting. Your dad loves this stuff. He should do that all the time. I know, but they get nervous without me, you know, my guidance. <laughs> It's you Garrett, Garrett Cole. Like, you want me to break? I'm like, if you want to. I'm, I'm saying it's the, gonna be. A they're just nervous. Break. Nobody wants to get you mad. Yeah, Turns into the Hulk, ladies and gentlemen. There's gonna be like a lot of like. like people, I'm saying there's gonna be a lot of people watching and like something. Talking. Something doesn't go right. The 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 uh, it's it's like uh, it's like the the Kobe Bryant stare from the bench. Like yeah. when you, you're like, oh, you don't want that. You don't want. Alright, we're almost done, folks. We're only at the hour mark. We're going to do this. If I did this solo, this would have been like a two-hour break, ladies and gentlemen. We might finish this in an hour and 20 minutes. So big thanks to Nick for helping up hack a stack. We've got a train whistle, had a printing plate, had that Scherzer patch auto. I mean, I know I'm blowing by a ton of these rookies, but a ton of rookies, too. And we got Sean Murphy, rookie auto. A's, 185 to 199. So, and it's worth keeping all these rookies too, because you don't know, and they're all shipping obviously, you don't know what these guys are going to turn out to be. What are we giving away in these raffles? Some boxes, some blaster boxes, some packs. Charlie Carlson. Some ball packs. Nice. Yeah, we opened the blue packs, but haven't shown them yet. Yeah, those are the blue packs back there, Frank. Those are the box toppers right in front. Prism football? 2019 Prism football. Oh, last year. I was like, hobby box I was like were we giving away hobby boxes? $200. Yeah, I was like... like Minor prize. Yeah. Where is this, like... On a free trade night. We get audited by the IRS right away. Yeah, they're like, they're, these guys are definitely laundering money. And we got a Vlad Guerrero Jr., and look at that little Ray right there. That's kind of cute. Blake Snell, Tampa Bay Rays. Paul Hutchins with that one. Ooh. 
got Julio Tehran, 22 out of 99 for the Braves. That's going to go to Dwayne and the Bravos. You like these Manny patches? I kind of do, yeah. yeah. It's not bad. I'm not, I mean, I'm. I mean, it'd be just, just it'd be fun to collect. Hit, oh, they're calling them hits, though. Yeah, the, oh. the medallions and these count as um, a relic. Wow. Bo Bichette autograph, rookie auto. That is nice. That'll go to Diane and the Blue Jays. She got randomized the Bluebirds in this one. That's one of the bigger rookies of this season. He should have a good season, I think. I think Blue Jays could be sneaky good, right? Got Cavan Biggio. I'm going to cheat and say this was hit. Bo Bichette. This, this was hit at our trade night. All right, there you go. Technically it was. <laughs> Technically it was, yeah. Uh, behind the scenes, folks. You get the behind the scenes look. There's Luis Garcia. Just pulled from our trade night. How'd the raffle go, Teddy? It went pretty good. Your kids win? A lot, yeah, lot, lot of smiles on people's faces? Yeah, a lot of smiles. Good, good, good. Some frowns, but we turned those some, into smiles. Ah, okay, okay. Let's turn those frowns upside down. You going live, Teddy? What's that? You going live? I think it's all right. Yeah, go live and have some fun here. Yeah, have a good time, Teddy. If you're looking for personal boxes, jaspies.com will be going live soon on Instagram. Instagram only. Instagram Live, at Jaspies Breaks. Here's Robbie Grossman to 25. Nice low number for the A's. That'll go to EA with the OA combo. We've got a Ozzy Albies. Big medallion there. I'm a huge fan of Netherlands. Tops, that. Tops is great. I love Tops. They've always taken care of us. I've been making baseball cards since the 50s. Right. I mean, you can argue even before that, too. You know, and they also support our local hobby shop. They do. They invite us to events. They do. Ricky Henderson. And their employees are very friendly, but yeah, I was a little disappointed we didn't get in there. The interview, I know. But I'm very appreciative of them. I thought I missed the interview. Yeah. And I was like, I was when's our interview? I'm there, ready, man. There was, you see, we, I broke with V. I don't know if people know this because I didn't have a lot of viewers on Facebook. I've ha I opened packs with the Dr. James Beckett. Whoa. Have you heard of him? Created the Beckett. I've heard of him. Inventor of the Beckett. I've heard of him. I opened some packs and I was the only person who broke with him because he knew my grandfather. Right. Right. We're a generational hobby business, ladies and gentlemen. Not too many breaking you, operations can password. say that. He knows the password. He knows the password. Okay. All right, there's Barry Larkin to 199. He's a Dr. James Beckett, but people may know him as Mr. Beckett. All right. Old Jim. Yep. See, Nick, some people think we just figured out how to do this group rank thing yesterday. Yeah. But... He was saying I might be one of the only third generation collect like people in the industry. I said you might be I right. I think so. We talked about that. There's Chris Bryant. He might get traded. Thanks, nice, Avery Bradley. Yeah, got interviewed by. Uh, uh, yeah. So what? What's so? What's that Sports Illustrated story? What's when's that coming she out? She asked me about the shop and how we got into it and breaking and what do we think about this event. I gave her some great answers. Nice, nice. Until she twists your words, and then she just uses part of your quotes, and then you're gonna have to release a statement being like that was taken out of context. Fake news. Yeah, imagine being able to say that you were taken out of context. Yeah, that's a power move. That's a power move. It's like, that's not true. I was taken out of context. I was ambushed by this so-called journalist. Pete Alonzo opened the very first pack with his teeth. That's 99 for the Orioles. That'll be for EA. 
was funny. Speed Alonso nice. He seemed great on camera. Yeah, he was cool. He seemed like I, I was telling this to some other people in the shop because the people in the shop were here too, watching. I put it on the TV. Like it seemed like he was really into the event. Like he was yeah. like totally in, like for the so, yeah. few hours he was there, he seemed pretty excited about it. He was yeah, all I think into he was it. A good person to pick. Uh, the plate was Anthony K. The Blue Jays. And we got an a, uh, an autograph. DJ LeMayhew. That's for the Yankees. That's going to go to Jeff Minton. Not numbered, but a nice DJ LeMayhew autograph. Yeah. Did he win the batting title last year? Did who win the batting title? DJ LeMayhew for in the AL. Just uh, go to the go to, go down to the ocean and just like drink some of that salt water down there. Clear that out. Clear that out. I heard a tip for sore throat. What was it? I was gonna tell you about. Salt water. Aloe vera. You can't put aloe vera in your mouth. Yeah, they have it. They have oh, they have like liquid versions. Yeah, and I heard that's like wonders. Wow. That's my even my one of my aunts posted on Facebook. It's just it's like just bit. home remedy. Yeah. Yeah, aunts always know that kind of stuff. Aunts, grandmas. All right, last box right here. Then the uh, silver pack cards, and the, we'll do box hoppers and silver pack cards. No appearance for my siblings. Tonight. And no, Marin's just too good for us. Both of them. Alex not here. All right, there. Oh, it's a Saturday too. I was gonna be like, you know, probably traffic for Alex. I was like, no, it's a Saturday. He should be here. It's too, too, too busy like selling servers, I guess. Probably seen like, you know, Les Miserables at the Disney concert hall. Les Miserables garbage. Or I guess the non Broadway, the movie I feel like was just. I don't need to see a yeah, movie like that. They open their car shop and they invite me to their trade night. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Here's an Alvarez. The you other. You I found one. Yeah. The other Jaspies. Whatever they call theirs. Jaspersons. <clears throat> Hit recap? That's up to Joe. No, actually, I will, because it's everything's top-loaded, so... Makes it yeah, easy. Nico Horner's going to be a good rookie. I mean, it's Marcakis, 220. <laughs> I mean, he looked good in, like, the first... In the couple weeks that he was up for the Cubs last year. I think the McDavid so, is going in April. And I think when we were when we were looking for Nico Horners in like Bowman draft a couple of years ago, a year or two ago, two years, two, three years ago now. Um there's Paul DeYoung for the Cardinals, that goes to Ryan. I think a lot of people were chasing Nico's. Cubs fans for sure. And then he's kind of steadily gone up the minor league ranks. So hopefully he turns out to be an everyday guy. Maybe not platooned or anything like that. Kind of get him a regular position. Whether it's a hot card or not, that, that'll all depend on what... Oh, that's David Bodie. On what he decides to do at the plate. I'll pull out all the heads. Because we're not doing all those. That's 300. Yeah, I would hold on to it. Because I don't think he has... It. I guess he has a decent amount of hype, but I don't know if he has the hype to to really like... to be like, oh, you got to sell now, you know? I think you could risk, you know, waiting on him, in my opinion. It's supposed to play. Box toppers. Are any of these numbered or autographed? Could they be? I don't know. But it looks like none in this case here. What are you doing? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Why don't you collide? No, I, I, when I got the laptop. I, I, there's no charger on it. Uh, I got to get into uh, 
All right, now there can be autographs here. I've seen them before. That's numbered. There it is, to 199, Glaber Day. That's for the Yankees, of course. I'll go to Jeff Minton. I see a little red back there, too. What are those reds numbered to? Ooh, Frank Thomas White Sox. Kevin M. Two out of five. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. <laughs> we run out top loaders? Yeah, we'll set that right there for a, for a second. Nice one for Kevin and the White Sox. No, uh, oh, that's right to my left? My, my right? I don't even know my lefts and rights anymore. Hi, Sean. Oh, you got uh, oh God, there go the top loaders. you banned Sean already. No, I've never, I've never banned Sean. I would never ban Sean. Ever. You kind of did, right? A, time, a, a timeout, a timeout is very... Time out is very different That's from even band. More Why? No, it's not. It's like playful, isn't it? No. No? <laughs> out of 299 Aces Lazardo for EA and the A's. I saw He's that. He's supposed to be pretty when good I was too. I breaking on Facebook. I said, wow. Oh, must have boy. Said something really that made it was, he was only timed out. I quit, you guys. This is my last break. I'm done. Whit Merrifield to 150. That was funny though. I saw, I saw Sean Corbett time that for 300 <laughs> seconds. It's only five minutes. It's not even that long. What if he was going to buy a case of like flawless? I'm sure he will. If he was going to, he would have done it. All right. There you go. Done. Separate video or same video? No, same video. Hit recap at the end is what I'll put in the description. Here you go. An example of what was pulled. Some nice Jordan Alvarez's, the nice Lazardo autograph, who I think should have a pretty good season this year. Some medallions, some Isan Diaz's. This Max Scherzer relic auto to 50 was pretty neat. These are some variations right here. Nola autograph for the Phillies. There was the plate right there. Bellinger relic. That Frank Thomas was a train whistle. Two out of five. That was pretty sweet. Sean, I like these. Bo Bichette autograph. That was pretty, pretty nice. Some good manufactured relics and some medallions and some game-used jerseys. And there you go. And probably a bunch of other rookie cards and inserts and all sorts of fun stuff that will be going your way. Remember, each team also gets a, uh, a stack of 75 random veteran commons that we'll randomly pull out of there just so you can have a stack of those. And there you go. Thanks for getting into our Series 1 doubleheader, ladies and gentlemen. There will be some more in the store if you missed out the first time. So check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. This is Joe. I'll break with you next time. Bye-bye.